Hi everybody! Welcome back to Baby Storytime with Hennepin County Library. My name is Robin and I'm a Youth Services Librarian at Minneapolis Central Library and I'm so happy to be here with you today. I know we can't be together in person but this is the next best thing. All right, so we usually get started with our babies in our laps at Baby Story Time. But for this song, um, I'm gonna keep Babe over here. He's my baby today. Um, because we're gonna do some signing with our opening song. And I do just wanna mention that I am not fluent in American Sign Language, um, but signing can be a good way for you to communicate with your child before they can talk. Um, but of course, Sign language is some people's first and only language, and if you want to learn more about sign language, um, contact the library and we can get you some more information about that. All right, so with that being said, we're going to start our first song. So the sign we're going to learn is friend. So you're going to take two little fingers and then you're going to have them hug. That means friend. And then we're going to also say hello. So to do that, you're going to go like this and put your hand out. So, hello. All right, I think we're ready. So the song goes like this. Hello, friends. Hello, friends. Hello, friends. It's time to say hello. That was wonderful. All right, now that we've said hello, let's do another song to kind of wake up our bodies do a little bit of movement. Okay, so I'm gonna hold Babe up a little bit so you can see better. But for this song uh, called Wake Up Feet, which you may have heard, uh, we're gonna wiggle, wake up our feet, and then we're gonna wake up our arms, and then we're gonna wake up our ears to get ready to hear a story. All right, should we get started? Okay, sing along if you know it. Wake up feet, wake up feet, feet wake up feet and wiggle 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 wake up feet wake up feet wake up and wiggle in the morning wake up hands wake up hands wake up hands and wiggle 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 wake up hands wake up hands wake up and wiggle in the morning all right wake up ears wake up ears wake up and wiggle in the morning wake up ears wake up ears wake up and wiggle in the morning i think i left out a wiggle 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 don't forget to do that all right, now that we've waken up our bodies, let's do our story. Okay, so this story is based on a game that you may have played. And if there are any older kids watching, you can participate too. It's called Peekaboo. Yeah, I think you're familiar with that one. But this story is called Peek a Bruce. And Bruce is this big black bear we're gonna to get to know him a little better during this story. The uh, words and the pictures are by Ryan T. Higgins, and we are reading this with the author's permission. All right. The geese want to play with Bruce today. Here they are. Bruce does not want to play He's going for a walk alone. Let's join him. Now, you notice that Bruce has black fur. That's gonna help you later when we're doing some of the searching and finding. But where is Bruce? I think I see him. Point at the screen if you think you see Bruce. We found him. He was hiding behind the tree. That tree is too small to hide behind. Wait, where did Bruce go? 
What do you think? Do you see him? Point if you see him. I think I do. <gasps> there he is. We found him. Bruce was trying to look like a rock. He's too hairy to be a rock. <gasps> He's gone again. Where could he be this time? I think I see him. Do you see him? Point at the screen if you see him. <gasps> there he is. Silly Bruce. Bruce was hiding in the tub. That's a really silly place to hide. <laughs> you get all wet. Now where is Bruce? Do you see him? I think I do. <gasps> there he is. See his little ears poking out over the top of that chair? You can't hide from us, Bruce. The ducks just want to play. What a fun day everyone had. Finding Bruce. Good night, Bruce. Let's play this game again tomorrow. Oh, look at they're all asleep. The end. That was a great story. Thanks for going through it with me. Now we're gonna do another song. And for this one, it is fun to have a baby on your lap. Um, however, if they're not in the mood right now, you can always pause and come back to this later. Okay, so this one is called Tick Tock. And it goes like this. Tick tock, tick tock, I'm a little cuckoo clock. Tick tock, tick tock, now I'm striking one o'clock. Ready? Cuckoo! <laughs> Let's do that again. Tick tock, tick tock, I'm a little cuckoo clock. Tick tock, tick tock, now I'm striking two o'clock. Ready? Cuckoo! Cuckoo! <laughs> All right, one more time. Tick tock, tick tock, I'm a little cuckoo clock. Tick tock, tick tock, now I'm striking three o'clock. Ready? Cuckoo! 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 I hope you're having fun with this one. That always gets a lot of giggles at baby story time. All right, so babe, you're gonna go over here because I'm sorry to say it's already the end of story time, but it's not goodbye forever. It's just goodbye until the next baby story time. So we're gonna sing our goodbye song. It has the same tune as the hello song. And we're also going to use that sign for friend. Remember, it's your two fingers hugging each other. And then we're also gonna say goodbye, just like that. All right, here we go. Goodbye, friends. Goodbye, friends. Goodbye, friends. It's time to say goodbye. All right, it is time to say goodbye, but I just wanna remind you to keep talking, reading, singing, writing, and playing with each other uh, while we're all kind of still stuck indoors. And we hope to see you again soon, but we'll see you again at the next virtual story time. Bye-bye.